Uh, my book is covered with donuts and there is a reason for that. I wrote my partner a poem called Donuts to try and tell him how I was feeling. And uh, <laughs> he was a little bit confused to say the least. I said, just hear me out, okay? So hear me out, okay? Kindness is what oozes from your pores like sweet, sweet jam from a donut. And the first taste of sugar on my lips was so full of wonder that before I knew it, I'd eaten a five pack <laughs> and fallen for you deeply. You were confident and self-assured yet sensitive. I'd soothe a beautiful soul like yours any day. Spectrums of colour would bubble under your surface and I was the only one who could see you for who you truly were. Magnificent in your entirety. End game, you, the two of us. I got to call you and tell you I loved you. I got to kiss you and nuzzle into your neck. I got to walk and talk with you hand in hand as we effortlessly faced life together. Whether the sun shone or not, there's not a lot of people who can say that in the way that I can, could, I can, can't I? Forgive me, sweet kindness. I'm struggling to remember, to recollect my thoughts and memories. Everything is laboured harder than before. The soft touch of your lips against mine or the safety I feel as our limbs intertwined. It feels like a different time drinking wine whilst fine dining eyelids batting butterflies' wings flutter in tummies full of Piccolino's pizza. But now I'm stranded on an island of not knowing where to go. I lie here wondering why, searching for answers like long forgotten footprints in the sand. You were everything I needed, encompassed into one human being, glowing beautifully like the sun on a winter's day. And I loved you in the way I always had, and even more, more, more time. I'm waiting by the sea, wondering if you'll follow me. Where do I begin? How do I let you in? Lost in my mind. Will you throw me a lifeline? Find me again. Thank you.